Well, I think it all started, what, 10 years ago when uh, for the first time I visited Washington State. I was invited to be, to judge in the Pacific Northwest wine competition. And I was amazed, I must say, because I didn't expect to, to see such a quality. I couldn't really believe that uh, in, in a state where you can fish salmon, you could also uh, grow uh, very high quality wines. What I was uh, impressed about the wines was really the fact that the wines produced here, in my opinion, were in a way rather similar to the old world wines in terms of style, um, elegance uh, of the wines um, and uh, also for that reason um, I felt at home uh, here and also for that reason I started to come here on a regular basis uh, to taste the wines. We got in touch with uh, Chateau Saint-Michel. We started to discuss together about the wines, the quality, the potential. The winemakers started to meet uh, and uh, to have many interesting first conversation and then also some experiments together. And, uh, and that's how I think the Col Solare project started, because at a certain stage we realized that these experiments were so interesting and exciting that it was really worthwhile uh, to try to do something together. And uh, that's how the project started and of course we are now delighted that we decided to, to do something together. I think the, the purpose for us was um, to try to learn something because this is an entirely different situation from ours, not only because uh, in uh, Italy we have a very old viticulture, but also because the conditions are entirely different. And uh, consequently for us it was very important to be able to learn something, also to bring our uh, experience in a way and to combine the two things. And um, so for us, um, to be able to produce a wine together with uh, our partners here, it's uh, something extremely valuable in terms of culture, in terms of know-how. Um, because, you know, it happens all the time to go in a different part of the world, to visit vineyards, to visit wineries, to discuss, but that's not enough to really learn something. You have to produce a wine together in order to have really the experience and all the advantage of, uh, of the cooperation.